Welcome back. So we got the top and bottom triple clamps all machined up. Now we're just going to sit down and do the process of sanding them all down and making them all smooth with a die grinder, scotch bright, sandpaper, all that jazz, make them all good. And then we will start working on the stem. But right now, let's get these things finished up. So I didn't get any of this on film, but I got the uh, shaft all made. It's all pressed in, hollowed out. There's a lot of work to hollow this out, all stainless. So that was a bit of a pain in the ass. Threads are all made for the bearing preload nut, little spanner nut here that I whipped up. Uh, marked, eight, scribed eight lines onto it. So we're going to drill some holes so we can use a pin wrench for it to tighten it up. And then made the bolt um, for the top to hold everything together and threaded it kind of turned it down on the lathe made it all smooth looks pretty good so now we just have to put it in the mill i think i'm going to use two regular six point nuts um these guys use them tighten them on um and just make them like back each one up put it in the mill so then we can index them off those nuts do the six cuts so we can have a bolt there and then drill these holes, that's what we'll do right now. And these trees are complete, that's it.
So here's the triple clamps, all finished up. Pretty happy with them. Uh, the bolt turned out pretty good. Top and bottom clamps, you've seen them a million times. They look good. That uh, spanner nut down there turned out pretty good. So I have to make a pin wrench for that. And uh, yeah, no. Besides that, they all look good. On the Olin's forks that I got. So they're off the Ducati 1098. So yeah, that's the triple clamps. That's how you do them. You got a little patience, a little time. And a milling machine, no reason why you can't do these. Thanks for watching.